What we make of the show is it's a very good showcase for us to uh, introduce our products and services to the market. Also we find as well as uh, seeing our existing customers, it's a very good format for networking with uh, other market factors and also finding new prospects to bring in. For the first year we came here purely as visitors but we were impressed by the footfall coming through and the quality of people we saw but we've been exhibiting since year two and uh, building the stand every year since then so it's getting bigger and bigger. We exhibit a lot around Europe and we go to a lot of the other larger exhibitions but what we find is a lot of the relevance there is starting to diminish if anything they're getting too high and uh, not really bringing in the right level of people that we're uh, hoping to try and find. We're finding from here we get people everywhere from the shop floor to the boardroom so you get a very good cross section. And what are the trends in the industry and how do sort of shows like this help sort of formulate those trends? Well the trend we're finding certainly for last year and well within to this year is the UK economy for composites is bucking a trend against mainland Europe. It is continuing to grow uh, at a steady pace and a more sustainable base. What we're finding here is uh, the exhibition certainly helps to encourage the confidence within the market and as we know that's where it all starts from. Any worries about this global slowdown that we're all hearing about? Global slowdown, yes. I mean, if you look at the UK, I think we've been in recession for 25 years, so we still managed to be uh, making a buck or two. I think we're more concerned with some of the uh, legislative information that's coming through from the EU and from China, but we try and stay very much in the forefront of that to try and offer solutions to the customers before it becomes a fact.